Jack Sparrow. You're so hot. Hey, you want to be my friend? Ah! No, I can't wait. Um, what are you reading? Um. Sorry. Um. You want to be my friend? Uh, no. I'm done with you. Oh, I have no friend. What the? Hi, have you ever been so lonely that you wanted to clone yourself so that way you can have a friend? Well, I know I have, so I'm going to teach you today how to clone yourself. Let's go. What? Step 1. Finding a cloning machine. The first step you're going to need in a cloning machine is you're going to have to find an actual cloning machine. A typical scanner or printer will work, but be careful. It might take some time. A scanner, scanner, scan. Oh, that's one! <sighs> Alright. Um, Alright, here we go. All right, make it work. All right. Ah. Ah, what kind of weird tiny booth is this? Oh. Well, I guess it's my turn. Ugh. Ugh. Happy birthday! Actually, it says cloning machine, dummy. Can't you uh, read? Look, cloning machine. Oh! Hey, hey, what? what? Wait, hi, oh, cloning. You're me. Yep, I'm you. Uh, ha! That came from the. That was not a tanning booth. Nope, it says it right there. I just explained it here to this yellow idiot. Cloning machine. No, this cannot be. I'm coming with you. Uh, I guess I'm gonna try. Okay, let's get on. <laughs> ah! Ah! No! <laughs> Step two: gathering a DNA sample. In order for you to actually use the machine successfully, it needs a piece of your DNA, like blood or a hair sample. Or in my case, a piece of my foot skin. Yeah, I'm in agonizing pain right now due to the fact that I tore off one of my foot skins. Uh, dude, are you saying I was birthed from foot skin? Ew! Ugh, teenagers, so dramatic. DNA! In that case, I'm gonna cut myself! Okay, here we are! Oh, I hope that's enough! But let's see how it works! Step 3. Stepping into the machine. Now's the part where you could step into the machine. Oh, don't worry. It's perfectly safe. Warning, do not use a cloning machine if you are pregnant, blind, deaf, mute, or have herpes, AIDS, shingles, the flu, sore throat, hemorrhoids, diarrhea, gonorrhea, or under the influence of drugs or alcohol. Trust me, you don't have anything to worry about. Isn't that right, cloney? Why am I in a red soil cup? Okay, push the button, and then one clone, and I'm finally gonna have a best friend! Step 4. Getting to know your clone. The best part about cloning yourself is that your clone will have the exact same interest of you. So, for example, I love cars, so that means my clone must love cars too. Dude, why did I get such a small car? Okay, now we wait.
Mom, what is taking so long? Cloning process complete. Oh, yes, it's alive. It's alive. <laughs> what the? <laughs> this guitar doesn't look like me. Pika, pika, pika. What? Cloning process complete. <gasps> come on, come on, come on! What? Come on! Come Fun. Shut the f up! I ain't done with step part! Stop right there! Oh no! You're not supposed to yell at the host of this show. He's trying to go out of his way to help you get friends, you stupid little yellow alien. So why don't you show some respect and learn how to do the rules? Okay, okay, I'm sorry. I'm ready for step five now. Boss! Well, that's all the time we have for today. Thanks again for watching. I don't think so. I'm the real Shadow, so I'll be taking control of this show. What? You're not the real Shadow. You're just a clone of me. Everyone knows that. Oh, do they now? Well, why don't we ask them? Hey, guys, do you think I'm the real Shadow? Or is he the real Shadow? Um, obviously, they think I'm the real Shadow. Well, really? Well, chaos control. Um, I could say that too, you know. Uh, chaos control. Yeah, very convincing. Well, we'll just have to wait until they're done voting. I guess we will.